The playground and coal mine Sangri Grandi was decorated for the occasion, and the organizers took the time to recognize the sponsors who have assisted them, after which there was a sorting out of the football gear for the various age groups. The children were then taken through different drills prior to them engaging in mini football matches. The spectators were also on hand to witness the occasion, as most of them are parents and well-wishers of the day's activities. Former national youth coach and president of FC Santa Rosa, Keith Lockloy, was invited to speak to the youngsters, and he spoke on various topics, advising the children to study and be successful so they can give back to the community as both David and Marvin are doing. Lockloy also made an appeal to the Sangre Grande Regional Corporation. The need to encourage the authorities, um, the Sangre Grande Corporation, I believe it is, and I'm quite sure they're aware of it, um, they need to make an effort to support the effort of these young men. Um, David Austin, Marvin Austin, um, uh, Mr. Hippolyte, who is their father, who I taught with in Malik back in the 80s. This field could be easily the center of community life. David Austin also made an appeal to both parents, guardians, and elders in the community. So we want to encourage the community, um, you know, to come out and take part in, in their kids' lives you know, really push them and support them in every way and every which way that they can. Um, encourage them, um, you know, in sports, it's a great way, to, it's a great way to, you know, to, you know, pass the time. His brother Marvin also paid tribute to their parents for the values they have instilled in them from very early in their lives. I must commend, you know, the foundation. I just want to say, you know, thanks to my mother, Paul, Hippolyte and father. John Hippolyte for really giving us and showing us the way so that we can pave the way for the kids and also show what we are about in Excel. Astil Ren, CNC3 Sports.